Every 10 hours, another Australian woman dies because of ovarian cancer. That's one too many. Donate now to the OCRF and help us find an early detection test that will save women's lives. You, you, you and the guys from L'Oreal Paris and um, you've teamed up with the Ovarian Cancer Research Foundation to talk about this scary statistic that we keep saying that you have on your t-shirt yes. today. Is hashtag one, 10 hours. Hashtag 10 hours. An Australian woman dies every 10 hours of ovarian cancer. ovarian cancer that's in australia alone that's Isn't correct that frightening it's frightening it's a statistic it's very real that not a lot of people know that yeah. stat the whole point of this fundraising is to develop an early detection test because there is not one currently and if you give an early detection test the you know that gives women the ability to, to hopefully try and stop this disease so in its one early stages. No, so not at all. Not, it's so not like with breast cancer, you can get a mammogram or an ultrasound right. and go, oh, okay, there's something wrong there. Let's get onto it. We've got it at the early stages. We've beaten it. There is nothing. It's almost baffling to think that it there's is. a statistic that bad and we don't have an early detection. For a disease for that's so widespread, yes. They're going to be high T's um, mm -hmm. uh, towards the end of August. Obviously yes. raising money yes. um, so that we can then eventually move towards having this early detection test. Yes, there's constant research being done, but obviously, you know, these researchers and, and scientists, that's their time and, mm -hmm. and, and obviously you need money to, to pay for their time, but also to develop the test yeah. itself. Yeah. And do you have a connection in your family with anyone who's been diagnosed with cancer? Luckily, I don't. But, um, you know, I feel like if, if there is one Australian woman that's being that's dying every 10 hours with this disease I feel like it's only a matter of time before yeah. I will know someone which is um, a terrible thought to have but it is it is a terrible thought to have but it's yeah. the reality of it um, and and I think you know it's something that's it's not a disease that affects you after a certain age and then and then it's something you need to be mindful of it's I've met women through this cause that are in their early 20s women who are in who are who are mothers, who are grandmothers. Um, mm. it, it really doesn't discriminate in terms of who it affects. Yeah. So that's another thing to be, to be mindful of.